What's up, YouTube family? Gerald Greenlee here with Cleaning Green Lawn Service in South Georgia. Um, I just want to take a minute and do a quick video. Um, I only encourage you to subscribe to three channels, okay? The first one, subscribe to my channel. Uh, now, that's not why I'm really doing it. But I do, as I put out one of my last videos, I do have... Uh, you know, 85% of the people that uh, watch the videos are not subscribed uh, to the channel. So, hey, I'd appreciate it. If you like this kind of content, lawn and, uh, you know, uh, lawn care or whatever, uh, you know, and some small product reviews, I guess, that you would uh, subscribe to this channel. Uh, but I wanted to uh, just give a shout out to a couple of channels this morning. Now, listen, before I do this, let me let me just kind of phrase this this way. And I know I'm probably not looking at the camera because it's just weird where it's over here and I don't know. Anyway, um, I watch a lot of great channels. Uh, I watch channels of people who have less than 100 subscribers. I watch channels of people who have thousands upon thousands of subscribers. Uh, I watch quite a few channels that have over 1K and uh, so it's, it's not my intent to, uh, you know, shout out or encourage you uh, to go to the larger channels. Nothing wrong with that. The truth of the matter is, if you're watching me, you're probably already watching somebody that's got thousands of subscribers, right? Because they have good content, and that's part of why they have thousands of subscribers. So, uh, but I got a couple of, uh, a handful of people that I watch, and... Uh, one of my uh, friends, uh, Josh, at Josh's Lawn and Landscape. Uh, hopefully you can, I kind of got this on my phone, uh, so you can see that logo. He just hit 250 subscribers. Uh, myself and Josh, we, uh, we have a lot of similarities. Um, we got about the same amount of subscribers. Uh, you know, we both uh, do lawn care on the side. Um, you know, and we both put videos out for people to watch. And so, uh, Josh is a great guy. Uh, he's a John Deere guy. Uh, well, he's been running a Taro, but I don't think it's actually his. Uh, but anyway, uh, he likes to put out some, you know, just down to earth videos, nothing flashy, not fancy graphics and over the top editing skills. Uh, just down to earth, simple folks kind of sharing uh, what we're doing with you. By the way, you probably never seen me with glasses on. Uh, I do. I did start wearing these a couple of weeks ago. I've officially joined the old man club. Uh, but, you know, I don't really need them when I'm out cutting. But uh, being in front of the computer, reading, studying, uh, sermon preparation, those kind of things, uh, I do need them. So, uh, that's, uh, again, that's, that's Josh. Uh, Josh's Lawn and Landscape. Uh, so, uh, and he's got 250 subscribers. So listen, if you're subscribed to my channel, you like uh, lawn and landscape stuff, go over there, check Josh out. At least watch some of his videos. Uh, you know, and I'd encourage you to uh, subscribe to his channel because I'm sure we don't have the same subscriber base. So um, the other thing is uh, I got another guy that I watch. I met this guy at uh, Lawn and Landscape Society event uh, 2020 in Hattiesburg, Mississippi. Uh, a great guy, again, somebody else I kind of have some things in common with uh, because, uh, you know, he's got a full-time job, does this on the side, uh, got his son helping him some, and uh, he's young. He's really young. Uh, and he doesn't put out a ton of videos, uh, and again, he's like me, they're not really fancy videos, uh, but that's Drew Hadwin, uh, New Beginnings uh, Landscaping, New Beginnings Landscaping. And uh, Drew is uh, Drew's a great guy. Again, just uh, down to earth. Uh, you know, this is what we're doing today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, he's like me; he likes to ramble on some. I think all of us uh, kind of do that. But again, uh, our videos aren't. You know, I don't. I don't think our videos are scripted. And I'm not saying other people's are. It's just uh, you know, kind of what you see is what you get. So, uh, so that's Josh's lawn and landscape. Uh, with Josh, that's uh, Drew Hadwin. Again, let me put him up here again. New beginning landscaping. Okay, new beginning landscaping. New beginnings landscaping. Actually, uh, he's got 89 subscribers. Looks like 
Uh, so this is what I want you to do. Uh, if you do this for me, if you're interested, if not, listen, that's fine. Uh, go over to these channels, watch a video, uh, drop them a comment, let them know that I sent you over there. One of the things we want to do, uh, one of the things I try to do in this business is, is that, you know, I want to support other people uh, that are in this business. And again, this is this is a part-time thing for me. It's not even something I got to do. Uh, matter of fact, while I'm sitting here, I'm not going, I'm not going to put the person's name up there. Uh, but I just got a text message and, uh, somebody was texting yesterday in the lawn care, uh, business. And, I, and again, I don't know a whole lot, but I try to help people when I can. And so he sent me an address of the property. Uh, I Google mapped it, mapped it out, uh, told him what I would charge, you know, and, uh, you know, so I, I sent him a message this morning said, did you bid on the lawn? He said, yeah, $50 weekly. I thought they only wanted it bi-weekly and was going to bid 55 to 60. Bi-weekly, uh, he wants it weekly, you know. And so this is somebody I just tried to help. Uh, the same individual sent me a, you know, a message about some hedge trimming. He, cause he seen me trimming hedges and putting pine straw down, you know, and just learning from other people. And listen, I don't mind telling somebody, look, that's what I'd charge for that property. Now I know we in different markets and you know, this, that, and the other, uh, but I even got a guy here locally uh, that I, you know, I, I, I tell him what I charge for properties, you know. And listen, if he wants to go under bid him $5 and get those properties, you know, if he can do that with a good conscience, and I don't think this guy would, but if he can do that with a good conscience and feel good about it, listen, I, I'm not worried about it. Now, I know it's probably a little different when you're in this business and it's putting food on your table again. I admit that if, if I were full-time in business, I depended on this, I'd probably look at some things differently. I'm not condemning anybody else, you know, that looks at it differently than I do. Uh, but my whole point in this video is supporting other guys uh, in terms of YouTube. You know, we all have uh, channels and, uh, you know, our channel will... To some degree, it will rise and fall on the, the content that we put out. Uh, but the other thing is name recognition and getting your name out there. Uh, you may, listen, you may you may be watching my videos and you may go over to Josh or to Drew and you might say, man, I like these videos better and you might quit watching mine. But you know what? That's okay because that's a, because you're watching them for your benefit and you might have never known about Josh or Drew had it not been for me mentioning them here. So I might just be the conduit that, that connects you with that channel. And if that's the case, that's fine, you know. Uh, but uh, those guys have been good about shouting me out too and, uh, you know, sharing my channel or whatever, or at least sharing my name on there, Clean and Green Lawn Service. So uh, anyway, hey, uh, I hope all of you are having a great day and I uh, just wanted to share that with you. Uh, go over there, drop those guys a comment, uh, you know, Tell them I sent you or don't tell them. It doesn't really matter. Anyway, I hope y'all have a great day. Uh, my prayer for you is always the same, that the Lord might richly bless you and that you might see all of your blessings as from him. Talk to y'all later.